Hello everyone, today I'm sharing nine of the best accessories that every woman needs. And these accessories are different, they're special, they're unique. You'll see what I mean as we go along. They'll serve multiple purposes and you'll be able to use them in unexpected ways. So everything that I'm sharing today is from Nordstrom. I've teamed up with them for this video. I love them to pieces, I always find the best stuff. So everything is available and linked down below in the description box. Also, if you're wondering about anything I'm wearing throughout this video, I will also have the clothes linked down below. Like this color block blouse is so high quality. I love the colors together. There's cream denim jeans that I'm wearing. They're high waisted and great. The basic like white button down blouse. I've worn that so much in recent videos. So that's definitely worth it. And then there's some other jeans and denim shorts that I'll be wearing as well. But again, everything is linked below. First up we have hats. And this is actually an accessory I kind of like rarely recommend because they're annoying. Like it's annoying to carry around, you have to worry about it, but number two will solve all of your problems. So just, just give me a second, but these hats are great. This is a newer one for me and I ordered it because of its shape. It's actually a Panama hat. It's super high quality. I love the coloring. It's just such an easy addition to many outfits. It just really takes it up like multiple notches and it just looks like you tried way harder than you did. And then we have this hat by Treasure and Bond and this one is really flexible. It actually comes in many colors. It's a very, very popular one. Um, it's not quite as big, so I feel like it's a little bit more wearable. I got it in black just because I didn't have a black hat, but you could also get it in neutral colors. And again, such an easy last minute thing to add to an outfit. The next accessory that has allowed me to accept hats back into my life is the Top Tote. And this is by Lindsay Albanese. She's actually a friend of mine on Instagram, but she invented this and now it's at Nordstrom and it's amazing. So let me just explain how it works. It's kind of like a keychain, but it's really simple. You just slip this on to any purse or bag or even suitcase, luggage, and you can travel with your hat, take your hat like anywhere, and there's always a spot for it. Now, it's kind of like a really, really strong magnet, but I'm talking like strong. So you, you clip this onto the brim of any hat and your hat's not going anywhere. It's not gonna fall off, but you always have a spot for it when you're not wearing the hat. So this is genius, so innovative, and it does come in many colors and patterns. Now we're gonna move on to jewelry. But again, if we are narrowing things down to the best jewelry, I want to share things that you'll be able to use and wear in multiple ways. So this necklace set, I think it's by Madewell. It is so high quality. I love the necklaces because not only are they just like really pretty and high quality, but also they come with three separate necklaces for the price of one. A lot of times when it comes to layered necklaces, they're all connected and you can really only wear it that way. Sometimes they get kind of twisted and I just don't love that, but this, is beautiful because if you only wanna wear one necklace, you can, um, especially that disc necklace. It's so reflective of the light and I just love it on its own. But if you do wanna create a layered look, you can add all three and then depending on your neck size, kind of adjust things and it's just way more versatile. So I definitely recommend this necklace set and you'll see a little bit later on in the video, I actually use one of the necklaces in a very unexpected way. Another piece of jewelry that I think every woman should have, like truly th these are just phenomenal. They're just stud earrings like stud CZ earrings. Um, this is actually by Nordstrom's like own brand and they're a perfect size, like they're noticeable. Um, they're not too big, they're not too small. They're super sparkly. I think you can get them in, you know, gold hardware or silver hardware. I just went with silver just to kind of, you know, not have the hardware kind of like peeking out around the diamond area, but you can just go with whatever, but you can just throw these on literally with any outfit, any necklace. Like it's just one of those classic staples everyone needs. Next we have a belt and it's not just any belt, it is a reversible belt. And that's the key. Again, versatility. There are so many additional ways you can wear this when you can flip between two different color tones. Now this is also a Tory Burch belt. So it is a little bit more pricey. You obviously don't have to splurge and go like the contemporary designer route. I do really like Tory Burch and you know, it's it's just kind of worth it to me to kind of splurge just because it, you'll be wearing it kind of double the amount of times, if that makes sense. But the way it works, I'm sure you, maybe you've seen, you know, reversible belts before, but this is like the main buckle. And then you actually just remove this, flip it around, and then you can wear it on either side. Now, again, with this little emblem later on in the video, I do use this for a completely different purpose. But back to the belt, I think this is just like a perfect one because it has the camel tones, which is more of the neutral, warm tone family. And then black is again, just very, very classic. And you can wear black all the time. The next best accessory that everyone needs 
is actually a square silk scarf. Now hear me out on this. This is actually one of my favorites of the entire video because again of how, how many ways you can actually wear this. A lot of you are thinking the typical ways, like you add this to an outfit, wear it around your neck, it jazzes things up. And that's true, but that's not even what I mean. You can actually wear this as a top, like as a shirt. And it's really simple. I'm going to share four different ways. And there's like so many more. You can even just like go onto TikTok or Instagram, or even just Google and just Google scarf top tutorial. And there are so many many different ways you can wear this. I think this is actually on sale. It's 100% silk. And again, the square size is really what you need. Um, but I think this is on sale. I'll link some other options too, if you're not into this particular color pattern. Um, this is very vibrant, but you can really just go with whatever you're drawn to. Okay, the first top is kind of like a halter top. Now, as I go along these little mini tutorials, I am wearing a bra just so you don't see my chest, but all of these tops are not revealing at all. Um, I just don't don't wanna, I just wanna be able to like show exactly how to do it and not reveal anything. But anyway, the first top is a halter. So what you're gonna do is tie the scarf around your waist and you're gonna have the back of the scarf facing outward. And then you'll just bring up the scarf to reveal the front. It's super vibrant and pretty. And then you'll tie it around your neck to create the halter. And then you'll just tuck it in in the front and boom, you have a beautiful vibrant halter tank top. The next top is also kind of a halter, but this time it's a little jazzed up. There's just some extra detail to it. But you're actually gonna do exactly the same thing. You'll tie it around your waist, bring it up, but this time you're going to actually tie it in front of you. And then you'll have two ends on either side that then go around your neck and you'll tie it at the back of your neck, but that creates a beautiful little detail in the front. Okay, so now we're gonna take things a step further and add even more detail. So this is where those necklaces come in. So you can use, you know, one of the necklaces that I just talked about like previously in this video, or you can just add whatever necklace you want. Um, but you're gonna take the scarf first and actually fold it in half to create like a large triangle. Then you'll put on a necklace and you'll take the center of the triangle pieces and actually just tie it to the necklace and then kind of flip it under. And then you'll bring the other ends of the triangle around your waist, tie it in the back. And then you have again, a beautiful top, but this time it's really accented with the necklace. The next top might be my favorite. And this is where I incorporate this Tory Burch emblem, which you don't have to use this. You can use like a ring, like a chunky ring if you want. Um, but I saw this and I was like, oh my gosh, I could totally make kind of like a Tory Burch shirt out of of this. So I took this off. What you're going to do with the scarf though is, you know, again, tie it around your waist, bring it up like we've been doing, and then actually take all of the fabric to one side. So this is going to be like a one shoulder top. Then you're going to take your ring or the belt emblem, whatever. And you're actually just going to stick the fabric through that ring. And it's going to create a beautiful detail. In my case, it looks like I'm wearing a Tory Burch shirt. And then you'll take that fabric and actually tie it in the back. And this is more of like a crop top, but again, you can really kind of make it specific to your style. You could use like gemstones. You could use a belt buckle like this and make it look kind of designer. Next we have sunglasses, which I feel like are everybody's favorite accessory. And I totally understand why. I mean, first of all, they, they actually serve a purpose, but then also they really do help out any outfit. I mean, I could be wearing the ugliest outfit and then I put on a pair of sunglasses and I look like more glam. Like it's just a cool little trick. Now I do think there is something to be said for splurging on designer sunglasses. Like I have this pair of Chanel sunglasses and you see the CCs on the side and, and I just love those. However, they're really pricey. And so if you wanna just have like a great pair of sunglasses that are high quality, um, but still are just never gonna go out of style, Ray-Bans. And I know a lot of you probably already have a good pair of Ray-Bans. If you don't, I have three options. I will link all of them down below and they all serve kind of just different color ways. So there's the classic black with the gradient. I've recommended these for probably a solid three years. They're the best. I also have a pair of beige that just looks good with my more neutral toned down outfits. And then I recently purchased this pair and this is different. This was actually inspired by one of my friends. Um, she has this 
this pair of sunglasses, or they're basically these, I think, um, but they're kind of like a light blue and they just look good on every skin tone. Like she looks so good in them. I tried them on and we have completely different complexions. And I just think this is an interesting um, option that a, not a lot of people have, but would look good on most people. Next, we're moving into the handbag category because a good handbag can also serve as a really good accessory, starting with this small shoulder bag. This is such a good accessory because of this gold chain strap. It just adds without you even trying, just an extra element to your outfit. And it's actually really comfortable. Um, and you can wear it like over your shoulder. You can also wear it on the crook of your arm. And this particular bag is really squishy. It holds so much and the, the zipper is really buttery smooth. Now, if you're somebody that you just wanna carry a heck of a lot more every day, this can also be a wonderful tote bag. Again, adds to your outfit. And this one is ex extra versatile. I've shared this before. I'm so sorry to repeat, but these are just best sellers at North Durham. Like these tote bags are just awesome for the money because you get two bags for the price of one. So the black one I have, um, it's actually black on one side. And then if you flip it inside out, it turns to a leopard bag. I think you can also get black and camel. And then this brown one that I have is brown on one side and then cream on the other side. So again, you can have a brown bag and also a cream bag depending on your outfit. Both options are really well priced. I think this one's like 28 bucks and this one's under 50, it's like 49, but again, you get two bags for the price of one. So I hope you really liked my accessory ideas. I just think that, you know, it's worth it to have these options in your closet so that you can add to any outfit and just make it better. So everything, like I mentioned, will be linked down below. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up, consider subscribing, and I will see you very soon in my next one. Bye.